And oh, oh man, there was some real, uh, real trolling on the clan base uh, forums about um, that they didn't mix up the South American uh, teams with the other teams that because they think that the South American teams are worse, so they wouldn't even get through the group stages, and now three of them will. Well, I think it's uh, <laughs> if you like playing against um, high pingers. Be my guest, but I don't think that. Uh, <laughs> I think the uh, clan base made a good decision on uh, not yeah. uh, putting them all into uh, different groups. Yeah, I think in that situation, there's, there's more positives to having them in the same group than negatives. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, here you can also see that uh, Slovakia and Turkey have never won anything in clan base at all. <laughs> Neither have any of the South American teams, but then again. Clan base is more or less for Europe only. I think Brazil, Brazil have always got a good shot. Got a very strong team. Isn't that football that they've got a good shot at? <laughs> <laughs> not, not in recent years. Not in recent no, years. that's true. True. Hey, I've been brought up in that era. <laughs> uh, Turnpike is uh, loaded, by the way. Ah, great. So, yeah, back to uh, Group A. But yeah, I think if you look at Group B, uh, Canada will definitely go through. Oh, <laughs> talking about my group now. Yeah, <laughs> it's UK, yeah. Well, both oh, of your dear. shoutcasters uh, <laughs> are uh, from the UK team, if I'm not mistaken. Mm. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't really sound so confident. <laughs> Well, we've, we've got a plan. We've oh, yeah. Is that we, called we Negev? Place, <laughs> <laughs> a special, unique United Kingdom plan. Yeah. Only British people know of it. Yeah. Oh, we can't know. <laughs> Is it secret? <laughs> <laughs> keep it secret. Keep it safe. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think could be. There's obviously Poland, Portugal, Canada. Two of the strong teams. It'll be a and tough fight for uh, the weak teams. Mm. Yeah, yeah it'll, there'll be some cracking games, I reckon, like Denmark, UK, Finland, Switzerland. I think there'll be some really close games that. Yeah. And of course, the uh, first UK match will be next Sunday versus Finland. So, looking, looking forward to that. To be having that, yeah. be nice to get the win but I think Finland will have a few things to say about that yeah I mean Homer from EO clan will also be playing so and several others from Finland but of course we'll have our own UK lineup and we hope for the best so this yeah, was Slovakia's choice right uh, yep. Yes, and, and it's on the on. Slovakian server as Good. well. I wonder if they'll have a tactic here, because I'm sure that uh, they didn't choose bomb just because they thought uh, they'd be. Well, uh, let let me just put it this way: I think. Choosing bomb is also a good uh, tactic because m a lot of players don't know how to play bomb. It's not oh, just starting. Team Survivor killing everybody. Oh, and we're hot. So I'll leave it over yeah, to the pro usually, shoutcasters. <laughs> usually in bomb <laughs> mode, it's quite easy to defend. So I'm expecting both teams really to to win the defensive side, but it's just who will win by the greater margin. Yeah, Us that's usually how turnpike bomb goes. Just play it similar to Team Survivor, but just with an objective for the red team. And of course, the blue team to eliminate the red team or deactivate the bomb. I think Slovakia there were lining up a, a delay rush on black, but Turkey saw them coming. And now they're moving around towards red bomb site. No flaking. Ranek. Ranek. And 
I think Turkey read that as well. Yeah, great defence by Turkey there. Defending both bomb sites. Crazy here, just I think communicating with his team, I'm guessing. Waiting for someone to come through offices and keeping on the defence of the red bomb site. And a second Flawless. win. Small killer being the last one. <laughs> nice knife kill there. Yeah. Taking out the destructive. Yeah. A strong defense so far. Yeah, I think with the, the maps only being published for each nation last night, Turkey is showing some good organisation here with maybe only a day's notice. Yeah, it was certainly a good choice for a uh, bomb mode. And a good map as well. Of course, yeah. Can't beat a bit of turnpike. In any game type, really. It's Always good fun to play. That's cool. Yeah, it's uh, all game type map. Nice uh, need. Back here again. We're the... trying to a delay on black here. Maybe being a bit too cautious. Crazy, ready to move in and kill. Pranic with the TK from Snowflake there. Six now. Destructive, still not having one single death yet. Well, I think if Slovakia want to have a chance when they switch to blue, they've got to get a couple of rounds in. They'll have to be heavily defensive and keep the uh, Turks from planting a bomb or eliminating their team. Pre-nades here from Destructive. No flight rushing through. Back here coming on the attack now. There's more like it. Don't be striking back though. Destructive playing over the fence here. I think he's trying to keep hold of that uh Nil point on the on the death ratio. Small killer protecting Branek who has the bomb. But crazy is hidden on this corner and will be listening out for the two. Line in wait. That's the first time Sabaki have managed to plant the bomb. Cold as hell taking them down though. Diffusing. Don't do a Nikes and jump. Or press T, which will uh, cancel <laughs> yeah. the, the diffuse. Yeah, I had, uh, had a match a few months ago and uh, Nikes on the Svakin team, he started jumping up and down and it ended up blowing up in his face. <laughs> <laughs> Bit of a bad mistake, nearly cost us the, uh, the match that did. The bomb is right next to the red bomb site. Ooh, nine but the rounds ended there by the Turks. Or well, if it's 10 0, that'll pretty much leave Slovakia without a shot. One last go here, though. The bomb down. Slovakia really need it. this round to stay in the game. 
It's all on Nikes. About 20%. Yeah, it looks like wow. the Turks have uh, beaten Slovakia in this match. So we wait for the second half, and of course, Slovakia can only get a draw for this map, which means that Turkey will uh, win the overall match with their CTF results. I think it'll be nice if Slovakia can win this half at least. Maybe put in a strong performance, get a 7-3 or an 8-2 win. Possibly 9-1. Yeah, it'd be nice see. to see a possible comeback. The Turkey have shown them 10 nil, 10 nil is possible. It's whether Slovakia can do the same. Yeah, I remember uh, preparing for this map. It was against BZ and Clan Base Cup, and uh, oh, it took me ages and ages trying to figure out how to uh, get the bomb planted and win the round on on the red side. It, it is really difficult. You didn't have to bind how to plant the bomb. <laughs> <laughs> I've been in public servers that had players like that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's really to frustrating. Tell you the truth, to tell you the truth uh, <laughs> it wasn't that long ago but I didn't have a bind the bomb. <laughs> and I was like, hang on a second. Oh, and actually, I think it was to defuse the bomb. I was like, which button is it? Well, the defuse <laughs> is the use button, button. but yeah. the plant yeah. is something definitely different. <laughs> yeah. Plant, you just scroll to it and press the attack button. As long as you're over the bomb site, it'll plant it. So if you can't plant, then... You've got a bit of a problem there. Yeah, but yeah. It, some people don't uh, have weapons scrolled, for instance, me. <laughs> well, you could just press 6, which would take you to it, but still, you've got to have that, that, that bound. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah. Second half has started. And Turkey have took out two of Slovakia's players. I think they're. Yep, they're moving into black. Turkey the winning the first round. round. Oh hell, Turkey! They won already, <laughs> <laughs> for sure now. But at least we know Slovakia have tried yeah, got, their best. Got two coming middle, three at Metro. I think definitely, if you're attacking, you've got to have two rushing middle. You're always guaranteed to get a backstab on one enemy, at least. Yeah, I remember that the aim was to get a few guys going middle, trying to distract and flank your opponent, and then the three at Metro move into plant at the right time. Like that. Yeah. Which is perfectly shown by Turkey here. Brennick, Brennick. the last man. One more. Destruction's just gonna wait him out here, wait for him to start defusing. And pop Brennick out. He needs yep. to rush in if he's going to do this. Oh, Taking out my oh, destructive. He had a shot at that as well. Logged how he didn't start defusing. Yeah, he, he had a good chance there. Knights taking out two Turkish players there, I think that was at Pillars. Well back for Medic. It's certainly a challenging game type. Crazy Definitely, having yeah. the bomb here. Moving through middle, this will surprise them for sure. Oh no, they're waiting. Is he a bit unsure what to do here? This last man could be the first round of this whole map for uh, Slovakia. Two men left on Slovakia's team. Get that bomb down, yep. He'll now draw the attention of Slovakia. 
which will allow him to finish him off. 